This is a little bit different of a tier list video than we usually do. With the Galazzo Show Evolution here, there is only 8 or 9 players that fit it, and basically the requirements for it is overall max 92, shooting max 92, and the dribbling max 91. It's a free evolution to do as well, so I thought today we would rank the 8 or 9 players in a tier list from S all the way down to, we'll probably only go to maybe C, because I don't think we'll need a D tier, because there's only like 8 or 9 players that are actually eligible for this evolution. So without further ado boys, let's get into it. For cheap, fast and reliable coins, make sure to head on over to MMOEXP.com and use my code DAVIS at checkout for 5% off your order. Coins are incredibly cheap right now. The links are in the description. So these are the only 9 eligible players that qualify for this evolution. You've got Vidic, Lineker, Desai, Ashley Cole, Sol Campbell, uh, Prince, and to be clear that's for 91 Prince, Van Persie's objective card, Shabby Alonso's objective card, and Essien who is available as an SVC. Let's get ranking. 91 Shabby Alonso. Now I like this card a lot just for the fact that he's free. In terms of value he is easily an A tier, probably even an S tier. But we are ranking it on the actual card's ability. For me he's going into the B tier. But as I said, he's a free card. You can make his 90 rated card, which takes 10 games, and turn him into a 91 rated card. And what I really like about this card, and why I think it is incredible value, if we jump on over to Footbin here. Now, this is the evolved Shabby Alonso, and comparing him to his 93 on the market, he's got one more pace, one more shooting, two less passing, two less dribbling, two less defending, and one more physical. So he's got, you know, minus twos in the passing, dribbling, and defending, but he's got more physical, more pace, and more shooting. And I mean, this is free, remember. His 93 on the market with the exact same play styles as well is 400k. So, you know, his 93 is better, but it's pretty marginal. So the fact that you can make a 91 rated Shabby Alonso for free, you cannot complain. Great if you're on a budget or maybe doing a road to glory. In fact, I think B is too harsh. We're putting him into the A, and I think Van Persie is going to be going into the B tier. He goes to 95 shooting, of course. This is also the free objective Van Persie. Um, the thing is, though, his 91 rated card which is still better than his 90 rated uh, is only 50 60 000 coins so you'd almost be more beneficial to use this evolution on someone else like shabby alonso and then just save up 60 000 coins and buy van Persie's 91 rated anyway uh, he's not bad that's why he's not in a c tier but i think if you're going off a of value it makes more sense to use this on someone else so he goes into the b tier uh Vidic. Turning his little bro, his 91, we're calling the lower rated cards the little bro versions of the cards. 91, are turning him into a 92. His 93 on the market is, I'm pretty sure it's like 400, 500,000 coins. Um, once again, his 93 looks better, but not significantly better. And I, I can't help but say if his 92 was on the market, he would be at least a couple hundred thousand coins going off of the price of his 93 rated, or he might even be 94, whatever his bigger version is. Uh, for me, Vidic is going into... The higher end of A, I'm actually debating debating putting him into S, but there's one player on this list for me that is going into S, and you guys will see that shortly, like one guaranteed player, and I'm not sure if I'll put Vidic on the same level as that. I don't know, I might actually, I might change Vidic to S, you know. I don't, you know what, we're going to put Vidic to S, we're, we're going to do it. Uh, Sol Campbell, I'm going to put into A, the higher end of A, he goes to 90 pace with a boost as well, which is very nice. Ashley Cole, I'm also going to put with Sol Campbell in the A tier. If you saw my ranking, every Galazzo player, we both had Ashley Cole and Sol Campbell in the B tier, um, but obviously with these plus ones, we're going to keep them together. I think I actually prefer going off of positions, I think I actually edged towards Sol Campbell over Ashley Cole, but it was very, very close between them, obviously different positions are uh, both invincibles of course but it's very hard to judge a left back or compare a left back in a center back i think for the sake of there's a lot more center backs that you can get right now for 30 40 000 coins that just are very good i think it's harder to get a higher quality left back therefore we'll have ashley cole in the higher end of the a tier and there he is boys straight into the s tier is michael essien let's go ahead and take a look at his stats and it makes it even better that everybody in the game can get him done right now just using fodder in your club this sbc as you can see here expires on the 6th of june so you've still got over two months to complete him he's 830,000 coins do keep in mind though uh this expires in 20 days you have to unlock it or submit your player within 20 days so don't want to leave this sbc too late if you want to do it on SEN but you sh this evolution should still be available during TOTS so maybe you open during premium TOTS community TOTS you'll have fodder get SEN done turn him in to a 92 look at this card man look at this card I mean 
two stats below 90 and it's his, his passing and dribbling work rates high high you're probably looking at you uh, i did use his team of year and i liked it a lot you're probably looking for me i'll say an engine chemistry style and using him as a defensive minded center mid right like a six you you want to be using him as a six maybe in a more box-to-box -box role because i mean the shooting is really nice in fact i wouldn't blame you if you use them in a box-to-box -box, but i think a defensive center mid slash cdm is how you'll want to use this card and yeah this is a card that will last you up until team of the season easily and most likely throughout team of the season easily next up is prince for me she's going into the c tier now the reason i don't prefer her over van percy i believe she's got more pace and she might have more I think he's a physical. I think it's more pace and physical, but Van Persie's got one more shooting. He's got more dribbling. He's got more passing. Uh, Van Persie has also got the five-star skills, whereas Prince is four-star, four-star. And on top of that, Van Persie has got better play style pluses. He's got the technical and finesse shot, which are two incredible play style pluses. Prince has got press proven, which is okay, but for a striker, you don't really care. And she's also got, I think, I can't remember her other one, Travella. I'm pretty sure it's Travella. For me, she's gone straight to the C tier. Uh, next up is Gary Lineker, who you can pick up for 50,000 coins. Of course, make his 92 and 95. He does not have a higher rated card on the market. This is the only available Gary Lineker. I think he looks pretty good. Four star skills with a five star weak foot. You'll be wanting to go for an engine to give him that agility and balance boost. Um, he looks better than Van Persie, but I'm debating if I want to put him on the same tier as Shabby Alonso Campbell and Ashley Cole. He's either high tier B or he's a uh, lower tier A. Oh, ooh, you know what? I'm going to actually have a look at his play style pluses. He's got the power shot in Travella. I don't mind the Travella, but the power shot isn't very great. Van Persie's got better play style pluses than him. Van Persie's got two amazing play style pluses, in fact. Technical and finesse. Is, is fantastic so if Lineker had better play style pluses he'd be in the A but power shot is average so for me I, I don't mind Traveller as I said but we'll keep him in the B tier last but not least it is Desai who I'm going to put in the S tier and I actually think I'm going to put him um, ahead of Vidic I, I, I think this Desai card looks better than Vidic but the thing is though this 91 rated Vidic he's now gone up to about 90,000 coins this Desai is 350,000 coins right so you know he should be better because you are paying over triple the price uh, even quadruple right i don't know it's, it's it's too early in the morning to be doing mathematics but nonetheless i'm pretty happy with this tier list boys Essien, desai and vidic are my three s tier players cole and campbell and shabby alonso are my a tiers with lineker and van persie in the b and for me i wouldn't be doing it on prince um van persie's kind of also one of them that i feel like prince and van persie are the two out of void because you're probably better off just saving the coins you need 50 60k to get their better version that's in packs anyway and still have the evolution available you can only do the evolution one time if you've done the sc and sbc it's a no-brainer um if you have got now, if you've done the SE and SBC and you've also got Vidic untradeable, that's probably where it gets tricky, but I think I'd still probably edge towards SE in just because he looks insane. So let me know down below who you guys are doing this evolution on, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.